Hi everyone, that's Dorota Palicka, international nail artist and educator here and today we are going to play with some nice summer design. Have we proof of it in here? I hope you really like uh, learning those uh, techniques. If you do, let me know in the comments below as I'm looking forward to reading them all. Let's start! So another fun design um, and I hope you guys really uh, enjoy it. So let, let's play it. We are going to create some C and I'm going to use 237. So 237 and 220. That's a nice blue. I put them in together and maybe a drop of the white as well. So I've got like an all three colors. And then using the one stroke level one brush, because that's quite a decent size brush, we are going to, uh, to paint those uh, water in there. So I have mixed th those colors and I'm not worried how I'm painting them. Like I really kind of want to paint it at wavy and messy. Just so it imitates the water. We can even add a drop of the darker one, which is blueberry 201. Just a wee tiny drop, like from the top. And then on the bottom, we are going to paint the sand color, which is light latte. And give it a cure. Clean the brush. And we've got another one ready. Sand. Give it a cure. Then on this one we are going to do a super cool design. So we are going to paint it only a little bit of the water. And then a little bit of the water on this one as well. And this too, we want to cure. Okay, 
Okay, so the first one is uh, almost ready. We can move into the design part using the black. So that's the black I'm going to use. We will paint some palm trees. There is going to be some grass in there. And then palm trees. When I'm painting the palm trees, I do one, two, three, four, and five lines like this first. This is super quick way of doing it. Okay, and then once I've got the lines painted, I'm painting lots of smaller lines, just like this. It's easier for me to follow the shape and then the other ones from the top. That's really quick way of doing the palm trees. And they always look quick um, good done this way. Okay, so the first palm tree is painted. What else you can do it on the bottom? We can paint it a little bit of structure, just so it's not a straight line. You know, the palm tree isn't a straight. So just a couple of the dots. Palm trees looks cool on the ombre needles, like uh, oranges, yellows, pinks. Really easy design, guys. This looks almost like a stamp it in. and then give it a cure. Clean the brush and move on into the next design. Okay, so we've got some sand in here. Let's do the sand one. Sand is going to be cool and then we will do the shells as well. So actually I'm showing you three different techniques in one video. Okay, so for the sand uh, we are going to use, uh, where is the sand? This one. Okay, 
and same in here. And then sprinkle it with some clear acrylic powder. So we're just sprinkling the, the fresh color, which we didn't cure. Okay, we want to get the sand effect. Sprinkle it in and then take a dotting tool. And we are going to do a heart shape. Clean it. One, so sometimes you need to just clean it a little bit. And then there is a letter. Guess what letter? <laughs> <laughs> D and P. Oh gosh, Dorota, don't do it on your hand. Okay, we've got D and P. I quite like those fluffy bit, maybe it's a bit too much. And then we are going to give it a cure. So if we've got the love heart, we are going to write a letter a love on this one. You know, that's something what you do when you are spending a, some nice holiday on the beach. <laughs> Okay, so we've got love and another wee heart. Give it a cure. It looks like a sand is super cool. Okay, once the sand is cooked, I'm going to take a brush and just give it a little bit of shadow to it, uh, like inside with the latte. You could also paint it underneath and then do it um, like darker color. So when you scratch it, you've got this darker color. I'm just going to do it now. And then give it a cure. Okay, and then the love one. And give it a cure. Let's go back to the pantry. Just 
the palm tree is almost done. We are going to, to coat it and then do some 3D parts. So that's a part number three of our designs. So put the top coat, cure it. When the on the places where we've got acrylic, we don't need to top coat it, so I'm only top coating our waves. Same in here, only top coating the waves. Where is the empty one? Where are you? Okay, here is the empty one. So for the empty one, we are going to paint some shells and I will be using the white French gel with a drop of yellow mix it well you could even do it with this one okay and let's paint some so here is going to be a, a star Couple of the dots. And then on the beach, we are going to paint some shell. Okay, and then kind of triangle shape. And another shell. Color that in. And then again, give it a couple of the dots. Just needing a drop more of this latter color. And give it a cure. Okay, palm tree is done. So we are going to, and they are top coated. So we are using the white gel on its own. It doesn't need to have a top coat if it's a small parts of the design. Okay, 
is we are just painting some shapes. And give it a cook. The shell one we can top coat it. This one will be finished as well. We just have to add some waves. Make it nice and foamy. And then cure it. Same in here. Give a wiggle. Like, don't try to paint it straight. It will look nice and foamy if you go like this. And give it a cure. The shelves are top coated so we can move on into the next part. So very little white. And we're putting some texture. Okay, we've got first shell ready. Next shell. And again, we've got some texture. Couple dots on the star. And then wavy form. I give it nice shakes to it. And then give it a cure. And I can show you, I think that's all of them. I can show you what we have created today. I think it looks super cool together. And they kind of quite quick designs as well I would say and interesting something different for a summer the white has a tiny bit of the inhibition layer so make sure you do remove that you don't want any you can also remove excess of the acrylic powder which you've got in there and then we've got some love we've got 
off we've got the heart okay so I'm just cleaning it really well Clean this one well. And then the last one. Nice, quick and easy. Summer nail art. I think it's actually pretty cool. I hope you have guys really uh, enjoy it. Uh, I'm sending you lots of glittery hugs and bye for now. <laughs>